Good morning, everyone, and welcome to our morning inspiration, Wednesday, February 14, 2024. I hope that we are doing well today, and I hope that we had a good night's rest. And as we go through today, I pray that you will remember that God loves you and that He has good things in store for you. Our reading today comes to us from Psalms 136 and we will read verse 1 to 26. It says, O give thanks unto the Lord, for he is good, for his mercy endureth forever. O give thanks unto the God of gods, for his mercy endureth forever. O give thanks to the Lord of lords, for his mercy endureth forever. To him who alone doeth great wonders, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that by wisdom made the heavens, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that stretcheth out the earth above the waters, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that made great lights, for his mercy endureth forever. The sun to rule by day, for his mercy endureth forever. The moon and stars to rule by night, for his mercy endureth forever. To him that smote Egypt in their firstborn, for his mercy endureth forever, and brought out Israel from among them, for his mercy endureth forever. With a strong hand and with a stretched out arm, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which divided the Red Sea into parts, for his mercy endureth forever, and made Israel to pass through the midst of it, for his mercy endureth forever. But overthrew Pharaoh and his hosts in the Red Sea, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which lead his people through the wilderness, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which led his people through the wilderness, for his mercy endureth forever. To him which smote great kings, for his mercy endureth forever. And slew famous kings, for his mercy endureth forever. Sion, king of the Amorites, for his mercy endureth forever. And Og, the king of Bashan, for his mercy endureth forever and gave their land for an heritage, for his mercy endureth forever. Even an heritage unto Israel his servant, for his mercy endureth forever. Who remember us in our low estate, for his mercy endureth forever. And hath redeemed us from our enemies, for his mercy endureth forever. Who giveth food to all flesh, for his mercy endureth forever. O give thanks unto the God of heaven, for his mercy endureth forever. Amen. We give God thanks again for his holy word. And as we think about the word this morning, we realize that there is a lot to give God thanks for. We are to thank God for his goodness and for his mercies, because were not it for his grace and his mercy, where would we be today? History teaches us about how merciful God is. And also when we look in the present, we can see the merciful hand of God working. He woke us up this morning. That's because of his mercy. He protected us through the night. Whenever we go on the road, his protection surrounds us. That's because of his mercy. When we look at how much God provide for us each day when we look at our life and examine how good he has been to us we can see that it's only because of his grace and his mercy it's not anything that you and i did and so creation teaches us and it teaches us about god's mercy and his grace oh he took the time create the heavens the earth and all that we see and then he formed man with such patience and care. And so we have so much friends to give God thanks for. You know, the story talks about when the children of Israel was in Egypt. Oh, God protected them. When they were traveling through the wilderness, God protected them from harm and from danger. He, he defeated kings for them and he destroyed the army of Pharaoh for them. He allowed them to walk through the Red Sea and Jailan. That is because of his mercy. And he's doing the very same for us today. God is mercy and his grace extends to us. Do you, when we look at 
what he did for us on Calvary, dying for sinful man, dying for you and for me. His grace and his mercy truly endures forever. To him belong all wisdom and power. He created the sun, the moon, the stars, the animals. Everything was made by God him. As we echo the sentiments of the song that God mercy endures forever. May we continue to look to him who is merciful, who is able to save, who is able to protect, who is able to guide, who is able to keep us from falling because truly his mercy endured forever. May we continue to remain faithful and continue to look to him who is merciful. Amen.